Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Laura. I hope you all had a good day. Thank you for stopping by and spending time with me. I am excited to bring you a new Dollar Tree haul. A bunch of great stuff hitting the Dollar Tree. If you are new here, welcome. I sure hope you consider hitting that subscribe button and turning on that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video and you won't miss out on an episode. If you are enjoying the video today, please smash that like button. It sure helps me out here on the channel a lot. I'm trying really hard to grow this channel, guys, so I can continue to bring you content every week. If you have any questions or if there's an item out there that you want me to look for and review, leave it in the comments below and I will get back to y'all on that. And if you haven't seen my other Dollar Tree videos, I will link them down in the description box, so take a look there. And I will also link some cooking videos. Don't forget about the cooking videos, guys. I post them two times a week. And most importantly, please share with family and friends, guys. That really helps me out. Okay, enough of the yakking. Let's get started. Okay, let's see what we are going to start off with today. Okay, let's get rid of the, the boring stuff first. I did have a repurchase. I did purchase three more of these solar lights. I did show in my last couple of videos, I did show a picture of how I used these around one of my oak trees. And unfortunately, one of them did not work, so I had to go back to the store and I picked up two more just in case. I really like the effects that it gives during the evening hours. It looks really pretty. I'm very surprised with these. So this is a good buy. I know I've mentioned plenty of times that I'm remodeling a little bit around my house. And in my laundry area, which is in my garage, does not look very pretty. So I decided to pick up these. These are the self-stick-on tiles, guys, the subway tiles. I've seen a lot of people haul these, a lot of people, oops, I had them upside down. I've seen a lot of people haul them and use them. They get very good reviews. They, stay, they say they stick nicely to the wall, but they don't have any problems with them. Since the area I'm working with is not that large, I thought, you know, let me give these a try. And for 20 bucks for a little makeover, that's not bad. So I am gonna use these. I will share the process with you, so stay tuned for that video. So I did pick up 20 of these. I may need more. Uh, typical me, I didn't measure before I went over there, so I may need a little bit more, but who knows, we'll see. Okay, I think that was it for that section. I did pick up a couple of more new storage things. I found this Crafter Square craft storage box, and it is like this. It has two little closures in the front here that you just flip up and open like that. And it does have a couple of little dividers in here that you can add to the box to make things smaller. This is a great item like for beads or you know little crafty things, little hooks and stuff that you use for crafting. I thought this was pretty nice. What I'm going to use this for is, because I'm a makeup junkie, I'm going to use this to store my extra eyelashes. Sometimes I take them off and I don't like to just throw them anywhere. So you put them in here, have them ready for use for the next time. So I thought this was pretty good. And then I did find these new, these were supposed to be in the teaching tree section. They had uh, yellow and green and clear, but they didn't have any more of those. So I ended up picking up two of the blue ones. And they snap on the top like this. Another great storage, you know, for the restroom, for under the counter, for crafty items. I can see this being used a million different ways. The way I'm going to use them, I'm going to use them to store my piping tips for my cake decorate. I think that's going to be really nice. They won't get dirty and they're nice and safe. And they seem like they're really nice and sturdy. A repurchase, guys. I love these baskets. I picked up three more. My organization project keeps going and going and going. I don't know when I'm ever going to finish. But I love the way things are looking. So I like these because they have a, let me take one out. They have these handles that you can grab them. But I'm putting them in my cabinets and I'm attaching my label on the front. And it looks really nice. So I'm really happy with these. They're nice and sturdy. I don't see these breaking down anytime soon. Okay, the rest of this stuff, we're just going to go in a random order. I'm excited to show you the next one. Y'all know I do a lot of cooking, a lot of baking, a lot of treat making. Look what I found. Look at the new bags, the treat bags. Look at these colors. Let me put them down to show you one by one. This is a dark blue, a royal blue in stripes. 
you get 10 bags per item. I use these all the time, so I love these. And then they have this new chevron. This is actually the color to my logo if you look on my channel. And again, 10. I love this color. And then we have the pink, this vibrant pink. It's beautiful, another chevron. And then we have this light orange corally color. Very, very pretty. And the last one is another royal blue in the chevron design. I love these. I got all of these. I will show you one day, or maybe I'll insert a picture here probably, of how I store these in another Dollar Tree container. Okay, in the stationary aisle, there wasn't too much stuff. I, I really didn't find anything. Can, can you believe I didn't find a notebook? I did find some more colored pencils. These are watercolor pencils. You get six pieces and they are the primary colors. You have black, purple, a light blue, green, yellow, and pink. And these guys are metallic. And you get silver, a teal, a red, like a burgundy, an orange, and a green in the metallic. Beautiful gifts to, to give is a, as what, with one of their large adult coloring books for fillers and a gift basket. I think somebody would actually love to receive that. I know I would if I got that. So these are a great buy. Okay, and then I did pick up this one, the home. And it does have like a little metal sheet, very thin. And then it's just that board in the back. And then it seems like the bottom is like a wood with this little garland around the O. I thought that was so pretty. And I did pick up the Love one on a previous haul and I really like it. I think it's very good quality for a dollar. Some more galvanized cutouts, metal cutouts. Look what I found, guys. I found the metal truck. There's nothing on it. It doesn't have the square around it. I thought this was adorable. And then I did get another blank for designs with my Cricut. And these were the only two, uh, the only two that I liked. They did have a whole bunch at my store. It seemed like nobody was picking them up, but these are great to have for your craft room. Okay, something new, Splash and Swim Pool Noodle Chair. Look at this, guys. I thought that was pretty cool. And it's in a green color. Uh, I have never tried this. If you've ever tried it, let us know in the comments if they actually work. It says it's 18 inches and it says, of course, pool noodle not included. Duh. So I'm going to see who I can find to give this a try. I will let y'all know. And if, or if you've tried it, let us know in the comments if they're okay. And then something new to my Dollar Tree, guys. Check this out. Some new face masks. I know the face masks are are kind of phasing out a little bit, but I think we're going to be using them for a little while longer. I have two packages of 10 each, and they do say that they are three-ply non-woven filtering material, elastic ear loop, internal wire for personalized fit, filters out dust, pollen, smoke, and other pollutions in air, soft and easy to breathe through. So I thought this was pretty nice for a dollar, guys. I mean, look at the designs. You got this kind of uh, camo and then, of course, the pink. That's all they had of these. I know that there's others, but they were running out very fast. So uh, 10 for a dollar, great buy. Okay, I'm going to hit the food section. Not too much there this time. I did find the So Natural Jasmine Rice in a one-pound bag. What a great deal. Great deal. This stuff is expensive in the grocery store, and I had never seen this before. I do find rice, but not jasmine rice. And I do use this a lot in my home, so I love that they're having it there at the Dollar Tree. And then, look what I found. Mariani cranberries and raisins. Can you believe? Let's see. The raisins are 5 ounces, and the cranberries are 4 ounces. And I know these... I see them at my grocery store. I know they are not a dollar. I'm going to actually look this up and tell y'all and write it in up here somewhere and let y'all know how much they are. And you can tell they're soft. You can tell it's a fresh product. And the best buy is January 2022. Same on the cranberries. So what a great buy, guys. Be on the lookout for these. I had one more thing for the stationary aisle that got lost here in my pile. This is a ballpoint pen with the little diamond on the top and the pink and the rose gold. I love to have these in my containers on my desk. I think they look very, very cute. 
or to give to somebody in a gift package. I think this would be really nice with a really nice notebook from the Dollar Tree. There's so many ideas at the Dollar Tree, guys. I could go on and on and on. And then I did find these DIY fashion gems. It says you can put it on footwear, tech accessories, sunglasses, and more. It is in the silver, the gold, and a bronzy color. I hope the camera is picking that up. And what I had never seen before is it does come with the glue. So what a bonus for that. I thought that was pretty nice. These gems, I like to use them to decorate small boxes. It actually looks like an upholstery tack. So I really like to use these. Okay, we're going to get into the beauty section. My favorite. I did find a few new things there. The first new thing that I found was this hair color application kit. A two-piece. Look at this, guys. Can you believe one dollar? I go to the beauty supply house and I buy these. They're not a dollar. They're like three or four dollars and the brush is extra. So, and it does come with the brush. Let me open it so we can see the quality of the brush. Okay, so here's the little bowl. I mean, it's not the greatest thing, but okay, it's great for what we need it. And then here's the brush and it actually comes with its own sleeve to protect it. And it comes with a small brush. And it feels like it's good quality, guys. I can't believe this. One dollar. Wow. Dollar Tree, what are you doing to us? I love this. That's going to come in very handy. Okay, and then another repurchase for me. I did buy, I did find the Ioni 3D Foam Mink Lashes. I picked up two more pair. I love these lashes, guys. They hold up really, really, really well. So if you're into lashes, pick these up. You will not regret it. I wear these just about every day. I love them. And one pair, I've been able to get like 9 or 10 uses out of them. So that is a great, great lash. Okay, next item. Some new hair ties or headbands by the Gimme. It says three fashion head wraps comfort fit. And look at these guys, how dainty and cute they are. I don't know if you're going to be able to see them. Look at that. The first one has little studs on it. The second one is like a lace. How pretty. And then this one is just like a braided gold. How cute. So three for a dollar. And then this is another new brand. The Gimme 3 Fashion Barrettes, guys. Look at this. Wow. Check this out large barrettes. I'm going to take one off so we can see it. These at my grocery store are $3 a barrette. Easily. Okay, there we go. Look at that. And look at the back. They are big. So what a great buy for $1. Great for a basket stocking stuffers, guys. I know it's kind of early, but never too early to start collecting the stocking stuffers. Okay, so there we go. Be on the lookout for these. They're pretty. And these are the only styles they had, or the only colors they had. Okay, and then I did find this sneaker cleaner. And it's a shoe eraser. It says, just add water. Easily cleans white soles. So if you have used this, I know this is not new, but I have never been able to find it in my Dollar Tree. And I found this by one of the cash registers. I went and looked around and I saw it there and I had seen him hauled before, but I've never been able to find it. So if you use it and it works, let us know in the comments so other people can pick some up if they work. I did find a couple of the Maybelline Vivid Matte Liquid Lipsticks and I found it in the pink this is the only color that they had that I liked. They did have a purple um, and some gray color. I'm not even sure. Maybe for Halloween. But anyway, uh, this is the only one that I found. Let me swatch it for you guys so you can see the color. And it is a matte. It's actually very, very pretty. So there's the color right there. It's actually very pretty. So I did pick one up. That's the only one I got. And look what I found. Finally, I couldn't believe what I saw. Check this out, guys. The, the Garnier Fructis Color Vibrancy Color Vibrancy Treat One Minute Hair Mask with Goji Extract. 
and this is a full size product 13.5 fluid ounces I could not believe it I have not been able to find it anywhere in my area guys I go to not one dollar tree I go to about six dollar tree so I'm always out there I'm always looking and I could not find them so I was thrilled to find this I am gonna try it I know Garnier is a good product it has been in the Dollar Tree now for a little bit I'm excited to try this coming to the last items guys I hope you stuck around this far Father's Day is coming you know I'm getting stuff together for a Father's Day basket I think I'm just about done when I walked into one of the Dollar Trees they had this men's grooming kit a four piece includes a tweezer a nail clipper a scissor and a comb look at that this is good for a travel bag to put into my blessing bags that I give out for homeless people to take to any of the shelters I think these are great products because they're small convenient people can carry them in their backpacks if you see them guys great donation item that is exactly what I'm going to use this for after I do the Father's Day basket. So uh, be on the lookout for these guys. I know a lot of people would appreciate them. Another item by Barbara Saw that I couldn't even believe and same thing. It's a great donation item. It's an ear nose trimmer with stainless steel blades. Battery powered. Check this out guys. For one dollar. A portable ear and nose trimmer by Barbasol. And it says washable heads run under water for easy cleaning. Requires one AA battery not included. What a great product for a donation item, guys. Good in your blessing bags. Good, good in a gift basket for dad. I can't even believe this is at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. Can't believe it. And the last item, I was so excited. I couldn't even believe this. Let me close it up so you can see it. Look at this travel bag, guys, in this canvas material. It comes with the handle. It comes with the zipper. And the inside looks like it's washable. Check that out. One dollar. I, I mean, this stuff just blows my mind. I can't even believe it. Again, another great donation item, guys. Great for blessing bags, for shelters. A wonderful product for people that I know would appreciate. Keep your eyes out for these guys. And that's going to that's gonna be it. That's my last item. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. I really enjoy making these Dollar Tree videos for you. If you want to see more, keep hitting that like button, guys. Okay, I'll talk to you all later. Have a wonderful day. Bye.